Well, it was an overall good week in sports in the state of Michigan. Welcome into the Sports Report, where it is weekly, every Monday, breaking down the sports we all know and love here in the state of Michigan. All right, let's start with college hockey. Michigan State is 3-1 and one so far in the young season. Lost to number two Boston College in game three, but keep beat them in game four. They have Canisius this next weekend. Michigan hockey is now three, two, and one. They beat St. Cloud number 13 on Friday and lost to them on Saturday. Next up for them is the United States National Development Team on Friday. They lost to Boston College. Eight to four. In basketball news, college basketball, Michigan State beat Northern Michigan 70 to 53 last Sunday. They play Ferris State on Tuesday. Michigan basketball beat Oakland at LCA Arena in an exhibition charity game. They won 92 to 48. Dusty May's team looks good. They passed the ball and played great defense. Five players were in double digits in points. Michigan plays Toledo on Friday. In college football news, Michigan State won a home game against Iowa 32-20. Childs was 22 of 30 for 256 yards and one touchdown. Michigan was at Illinois and lost 21-7. Tuttle was the key that did not turn, although he went 24-38 for 208 yards. He had one touchdown and one fumble, again, for the second consecutive week. And these two teams play each other this upcoming Saturday. Both teams are 4-3 and three currently. Now, to the professional side of things, the Lions... Uh, were four and one entering the Vikings den where they were five and zero oh, undefeated but both are now five and one after a 31 29 victory for the Lions Jared Goff was 22 of 25 for 280 yards and two passing touchdowns Jameer Gibbs was 15 carries for 116 yards and two touchdowns St. Brown had a day eight catches for 112 yards and a receiving touchdown and um, David Montgomery had a good day, but one bad fumble that went uh, to the house for the Vikings. And in Pistons news, their first game is on the 23rd, that is Wednesday this week, versus the Indiana Pacers. It is the second year for head coach Monty Williams. He was head coach for previous two previous teams and hit his best season was the 64-win season with New Orleans three years ago. Last year with Detroit, only 14 wins, which was the league's lowest win total, I believe. There you have it. Red Wings are dead last in the NHL Eastern Conference right now with a 1-3 and three record. So, and as you know, the Detroit Tigers season ended with a... Uh, NLCS or ALDS a divisional series lost to the Cleveland Guardians, who then lost to the New York Yankees. There you have it. The sports report. We'll see you uh, tomorrow for a Michigan football preview. Thank you, everybody. Have a great day out there.